You're watching the 2010 Asbury Automotive Group Walk Around, live from Nelly Lexus in Marietta, Georgia. Contestants were picked from Asbury Automotive Group's dealerships across the country. They were brought to Marietta, Georgia for the sales and service challenge at Nelly Lexus. The color guard, a drum line, and many dignitaries were brought out to celebrate. And what we did is at each dealership group, we said we want the best of our sales staff and our service client advisor staff to uh, compete uh, in, in showing how they would uh, address the customer's needs in buying a car and presenting the feature and benefits of those vehicles to the consumer, as well as when the customer is, has service, required service maintenance or, or maintenance, uh, warranty work done in the service lane, um, how we would approach that same uh, individual helping them out and suggesting other needs. So we've done this now in, in regions and today we are having the, uh, the finals here at the Lexus store in um, Marietta. Uh, we have nine individuals on the sales side and eight on the service side. Uh, they are competing in those, those two events. Uh, we will have our judges scores tally tonight and tomorrow we will have a luncheon to award uh, first, second, and third places to each of those categories. Well, they, you can't say there's just one important thing. The whole thing is important. Obviously, building rapport goes with not being said, but I think a lot of it is laying them on the right card and building value in the vehicle, which makes the rest of the process better. And just being professional in every aspect of the deal. I want to thank my boss, Paul Bush, Scott Sanders, for letting me come, and good luck to everyone else. 12 minutes is max. When we get to two minutes, I'm, I'm going to try to get rid of the contestants. You know, attention, we'll go two minutes, and then I'm gonna go one minute, and then I'm just gonna do like this when it's all over. Okay, so run out I don't anticipate we'll end up doing that, okay? But we might, we never know. Just somebody might get nervous or run on whatever. But uh, a couple of things about just what, what's gonna happen here. Karen, these, Karen has called in to each one of our advisors, and she has set up an appointment with them. That's what we're trying to drive this whole process to, the appointment process. And she has told them that she has a noise in the engine, a tap it noise in the engine at all. Okay? So that's the deal. This is the vehicle that you're looking at. But what he's going to do is just reconfirm the vehicle. So, hey, he's just going to introduce himself again. Hey, thank you for coming, Mr. Barnum. After the contestants were given the rules, it was time to hit the floor. Once you get into it, you get back into your rhythm that you do every day, so it's, it works out over. You know, again, I'm, I'm excited to be here. You'll get a chance to, to go through all this, you know, with cell phones, you guys will have a good time. Chris Draft, former Atlanta Falcon and now Washington Redskin, stopped by to give the contestants some motivation before they hit the floor. You and what I want to do is show you the things I like doing this. So one, you can check your fluids by sight. Okay. You don't have to touch them and get grease on your fingers. See that big yellow O? Mm -hmm. O for oil. That's how you check the oil. That's what guys like me can do those simple things, okay? But, um, you know, this motor is a four-cylinder, 2.5-liter motor. It's got 175 horsepower, but what that means is, is that she'll always be able to merge. She'll always be able to do what she needs to do and have enough power to do it. But it also means that the car is rated at 32 miles per gallon. And what that means to you is you're going to save money every single week when you drive right by that gas pump, if you know what I mean. Okay. What well, we're going to look at is that's the air filter box. They're going to pop that open for you. Now, on this side here, right here is the power check fluid. It's mm -hmm. full, good size. Brake fluid. Here's a fun little tool. We've just started using these, it's a brand new tool. I'm pretty excited about it. I want you to be the first one to see it. We're going to open up the brake canister here, okay? Get for the cork right with me. There we go. And we set the cap. What we do is these two little prongs here, we're going to set down into the fluid, mm -hmm. and we're going to press this little button here, and it's going to tell me condition of the fluid. Now you can see the orange lights right up at the very beginning. It says okay. So the brake fluid's in perfect condition. We don't need to do anything to it. Um, we also have a complimentary alignment check in the back of the shop runs over, it will stop real fast, and it checks the front and rear axles. Make sure they're dead center, that way you can get the maximum tire life on your vehicle. Uh, is that obviously there are um, all winners here. You all got here by doing what you do best and by winning at the various stages. So every single one of you is a winner today. 
what we wanted to do with this particular contest was, was not try to separate that piece of it, but to say, let's have a little fun. And let's see who can, for one little moment in time, be a winner for just that night. Third place from uh, McDavid, Lincoln Mercury, Plano, Sheena Sheriff. <laughs> Number, number two in the contest from uh, Honda St. Augustine, Hugh Bob Wright. In second place from Lexus and Galleria, James Roberts. Auto Group and all of its dealerships, we'd like to thank you for watching the 2010 Walk Around Challenge. Asbury Automotive.